<gasps> what? Am I back at school? But why? Hey, Susie, I've not seen you for a while. Susie, hello? Are you okay? Ugh, could you maybe stop chatting already? I'm presenting my report here. What? Why are you me? And you too? I'm... <gasps> no, this can't be for real. <sighs> so was this just a dream? Hey, why are you screaming and shaking like that? Oh, I just had a nightmare about school and there were three of me. Can you imagine? I can't actually, but it sounds great. Come on, you've got to tell me everything. Come on. Well, and then I, I mean, the actual me woke up. I can't imagine how it could have ended. Holy cannoli. Hello, it looks like I can help. <gasps> wow, box of dreams? So what's in there? Let's see. How did this end up here? Oh, huh. I dreamed about it last week. Sorry. <laughs> oh, it's a brand new playbook. That's exactly what I need. Let's see. Boom. <laughs> you can keep going, Susie. <laughs> oh, what a prankster. Look, here we have a cute pink bedroom and someone under the blanket. And on this side lives someone who clearly loves a more strict style. So it's already morning. The birds are singing outside the window and... <laughs> Rise and shine! Hey, it's mine! Give us that! Susie, what kind of a wake-up call is this? Can't you be more gentle? For example, I love waking up to the smell of freshly brewed coffee. Hmm. <sighs> is it morning already? <laughs> Oh, what a cute sleep mask you have. And your pajamas are pink. Oh, hey, it's still early. <laughs> Someone got up on the wrong foot. But the sleep mask is great. Oh, let me help you take it off. <laughs> Time to get ready for school. Let's see who will do it faster. The fans are tired of chanting. Pink, pink. Black, black. And the commentator is tired of commenting. Here, no, water, water. And Grumpy's the fastest in getting ready for school. I knew it, Sue. I'll go take her to the next spread. After you, miss. So slick, Sammy. Well, we won't leave you here, right? Great, we can move on. Huh, why is there nothing here? Hmm. Impossible. Here, take a magical croissant. And whoosh. Oh, strange. Well, at least I'll have a snack. Uh -huh. Mmm, wow, look at that! Ooh la la, with this we can already work! The winner from the first round goes first! <laughs> hey, I can't see anything like that! This requires an integrated approach, Susie! Bangs really suit you. You look stunning. Oh, give me a sec. We are live from TV Double Fashion Week. Big tails are an absolute trend. What, you want braids? Okay, let's give it a try then. Uh-huh. Ooh, great! Lots of fashion accessory and then maybe our grumpy girl will at least smile. Well, okay, I like it. Consider me smiling. Hey, what about me? I also want a new stylish look. Mm, well, I suggest taking some of the length off and bangs. A team of the best doll stylists is already working on it. It remains to add a stylish hair accessory. Now we're gonna call an expert. Oh la la! <gasps> no, it's all the way to perfect! <laughs> Do I hear? Is someone oh. crying? Oh no, 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 no! No need to cry! We'll think of something now. Look how many tears you've cried. You've almost drowned here. Ah, huh. hmm. You know, your pink tears gave me an idea. You won't be against fashionably colored strands, will you? <laughs> And here's some makeup for you. Huff, huff. I almost forgot. A drop of perfume for a good mood. And you can go to school now. <laughs> the black and pink school. Just like your nightmare, Sue. Ha 
Wow, so rude! So our girls are preparing for their first lesson. Let's see what they have in their school bags. Ahem, no one shall mess around in my classroom. <gasps> Professor Snape! Let's better not joke with him. Well, the pencil case is quite cute. And look how much stuff fits inside! I wonder what will happen if we mix both of these liquids. <laughs> You did it all wrong, Susan! Minus ten points from Gryffindor! Is that so? Hmm, well now I'll show you! <laughs> Let's see what you'll say to this, Professor! Ha <laughs> uh, ha! Whoa! <laughs> it tickles! Oh, stop it! Stop it now! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> That'll teach you! What is that? Oh, I've always dreamed of trying to write something with a real feather! <laughs> Seems like there's something left in here. <gasps> Sammy, how did you get so dirty? Oh, that's okay. We'll clean you up in no time. Uh huh. There. As good as new. <laughs> Ugh, finally, it's a break. I can have some rest. In the meantime, let's take a look at the pink doll's backpack. If that's not a purple pencil case, then I'm not a slime! <laughs> so close, Sammy! It's a makeup bag! Seriously? Whoa, 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 what is this? Ah! What happened to me? Is it just me or do I look different? But you said it yourself! Should you be wrong? You won't be a slime! <laughs> oh, I want to try this! Compartment on a zipper. Let's unfasten it. And inside. Yes! This is a pencil case. And look how cute it is. Now I want one for myself. <laughs> how many supplies are in here? And we can put everything on the desk. Oh, poor unfortunate me. There's no better shape than one of a slime. Oh, come on. The viewers and I forgive you. Am I right, friends? Give us a thumbs up if you agree. In the meantime, I'll get Sam into his proper shape. <laughs> so did my magic work, Sammy? Sammy? Oh, that's strange. What is that? Whoa, a Tamagotchi! Alrighty, we can take a walk. Now wash up, and finally, crunch crunch, have a delicious oh, snack. I'm a little hungry too. Oh, oh my, it's already lunchtime. But where's Sammy? <laughs> I'm me again, and I've managed to sneak a peek at the final spread. Well, here we are in the school cafeteria. <laughs> Here's a tray for you. For lunch today, we're having. Mmm, what a delicious scrambled egg squishy! Oh, I could really eat it! There's also this fine patty. It looks just like the real thing, am I right? And we couldn't do without some ice cream, of course! Mmm, delicious! And here's the place for it! Well, the pink lover's tray is full! Bon appetit! <laughs> I'm so lucky! Hey, I'm actually hungry too! Of course you are, your tray's already here! I wonder about the black food, though. Let's ask an expert about it! Mr. Squarepants, what do you have to say? Oh, hello, friends! Would you like to try a Darth Patty, our new product at Krusty Krab? No advertising! Over to you, Sue! <laughs> okay… Wow! Would you dare to try this, friends? Well, apparently the black lover prefers fast food! Here's a pizza slice… <laughs> and some chicken, also black! Let's put it here! And for the dessert, a carton of milk and a donut. I'd like to see that cow that gives black milk. <laughs> squish, squish, squish. Wow, this tray is completely full. Shall we play now? Do you want to see how we made this playbook? Then stay tuned. Ow! Oh, where's Sammy? What's taking so long? <gasps> Wow, where did this come from? Oh, save me, save you, I'm stuck! Oh, thank you. I wanted to prepare as much as possible for our craft, but this stupid date… You <laughs> did a great job, Sammy. Only the fun part is left.
And cut. Uh, where's the spread we need? <gasps> there are no beds here. I have them. I'm already counting so low. Well. Hmm, I think something's wrong here. Hop, now we're talking. Tape them together. Yeah, like this. Oh, I don't like that scotch tape anymore. But with it, the blanket won't go anywhere. And we can easily hide the doll under it. Oh, did you hear that? Who's there? <gasps> oh, there must be a picturesque view outside the window. That's right, Paper Sammy. That is why we're going to glue this on the back side of your playbook spread. Well, now that's better. Huh? huh? Am I not picturesque enough? Whoosh! Look how vividly I picture the girls. Oh, bravo, bravo, maestro. In the meantime, I'll take care of the hair for our beauties. Just look how cute and funny they turned out. <laughs> uh, I'm down too, Susie. <laughs> Good for you. By the way, we can even change their hair color. Mm, but we won't do that, of course. <laughs> ah, the most interesting part is coming. Yep, and the most labor-intensive. Oh, ew, Sammy. All right. First, let's take care of the school bags. Uh-huh. And then we'll deal with what will be stored inside. Forget about this little thingy, Sue. Oh, thanks. And the black school bag is going to its place. Super. Now let's deal with the pink unicorn backpack. But how do we put all this beauty in there? Hey, where's the lipstick? <laughs> Whoopsie. Everything to be stored in the pencil case is right here. Now let's just close it. And last but not least, a cute virtual friend. Well, we're at the finish line. Our last spread was about treats. We're gonna need lots of duct tape for this step. Huh? Uh-huh. That's right, Susie. Well done. Everything is correct. You know, these are not our first paper squishies. Be sure to check out our channel. Let's make it fuller. Uh-huh. And now we'll seal it. And... Wait, 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 wait. Why are we just stuffing it? Maybe we can store some goodies inside. Sammy, stop it. It's a squishy, not a secret stash. <laughs> now I'll put all the spreads together and our craft is done. Uh, well, where am I? This is some kind of school. Oh, is that me, Sue's dream, or what? Uh, Susie? Hello? Where are you? Hello, Sammy. Have you done your homework? Can I write it off? Ow, I don't get it. <gasps> huh? What are you staring at, Pink? Shiver me shudders. Oh, no, no, no. This is all strange. I have to wake up. Wake me up, somebody. And so it was all like this. She came in there and was like, Wah! and then she went the other way, but it was a restricted area. But she still entered. Then he, he deceived her. And she thought it was so over. Oh my, oh, horrible. Wah. But then she came and saved her. So eventually there was a happy ending. <laughs> Even though I watched this series, I didn't understand a thing. And what exactly didn't you understand? I told everything as it was. Why don't we make a super cool huh? book based on the Wednesday series to avoid confusion? Oh, yeah. I love this idea. Let's do it. Hi, all. So Sam and I made a bet on who will tell Wednesday's story the best. And now it's my turn. Friends, support me with a thumbs up. Our Wednesday gets into Nevermore and meets her roommate, a werewolf. 
they both need to correspond to Nevermore's dress code, but it is challenging. Ina just loves bright colors, especially pink, but everyone in Nevermore should wear blue uniform, luckily only in class. So for some other events like parties and strolling, Ina always wears pink. Oh, but here's another exception, the Edgar Allan Poe Cup. Even Enid was dressed in black there and wore a pair of cat ears. And afterwards, she happily got back to her room and changed into a very cozy nightgown. Aw, so cute! Wednesday, on the other hand, from day one, stuck to her favorite men in black style. It all comes from the family. The Adamses all look alike. They don't recognize any other colors when it comes to fashion. Luckily, there are events in Nevermore where black fits perfectly. Like when Wednesday became a part of Black Cat's team. <laughs> or when she went to the ball. Yep, her dress was also black, not white. The main thing here is to find the best matching hairstyle. Well, Ina didn't like that choice, but she's the kind one and didn't argue. But if our fashion designer Sam would someday come to Nevermore, I wouldn't be surprised if everyone changed their outfits to bright pink ones. Even thing. <laughs> Wednesday didn't like to study at school, but she was happy with the poke up. There were a lot of competitors, but definitely the toughest one were Bianca and Yoko. The most favorite and long-awaited entertainment in the monster school was boat race. The preparations were hot. Everyone in school came to cheer. So the girls got to the start line, checked in themselves and their gear. They have to cross the lake, get the flag, and bring it to the judges. And the race is on! The competitors have started! Wish them luck! And Wednesday won! Enid is very happy. Even Wednesday joins the celebration. Ah! Oh. Wednesday is not very emotional, unlike Enid or Sammy. <laughs> the award ceremony will take place in a festive environment at the ball. It was called the Raven Dance. Wednesday came there with Tyler. Can someone beat her in dancing, not just in boat racing? Well, I guess that's impossible. <laughs> Wednesday's just too good at everything. After the competition and the ball, it's so nice to come home for the holidays. Despite their terrible horror, the Adams family loves each other very much. Each of them has a role in the family. Let's say they share responsibilities. Lurch is a personal driver. Although it was a challenge to find a car, he's too tall. Thing fits easily everywhere. He's the Adams' most trusted helper. Gomez is the head of the family, and he always does what Morticia wants. And here's Pugsley, but no one should ever offend him, except for Wednesday. Gomez and Morticia also studied at Nevermore, and most of all, they love playing hide and seek. Imagine what would happen if the Adams family gathered in Nevermore? Anyway, Wednesday goes back and immediately gets into a secret order. <gasps> I didn't tell you anything about the order. Only few people know about it. All its secrets are written in this magical book. And I'll be writing down my secrets from Sam here. You won't tell him anything, will you? Let's hide it under the frame and he won't find out anything. <gasps> what a thing! Not Wednesday's helper, but an object. <laughs> I love anti-stress toys. You squish it for a couple of minutes and feel better. Okay, I got distracted a little. Let's get back to our story. What were we talking about? Oh yes, Wednesday plunged into school life again. Enid and Wednesday, very different at first, began to bond. Sure, 
Wednesday wouldn't admit it, but she got to like Enid. Eventually, they became best friends. Everybody at school were like pieces of a one puzzle. I guess that's what the headmistress was actually going for. From day to day, magical powers were growing inside the students. In the end, they decided to unite them. And they were able to sort of turn back time and return to the day it all started. Look, we ended up at the day one. Enid and Wednesday are together. Only now they're not rivals, but allies. So yeah, everything ended quite well. Oh, by the way, where's our Sam? It's time to find him. Here I am, and I have a surprise trick for you. One, two, three, look! <gasps> oh my god, Sammy! You made the book flat! Oh, what is left in it? Oh, who? At least Enid and Wednesday are here. It's time for them to take their places on the cover. Girls, come on. Who? Enid and Wednesday are already in place. Only one thing is missing. Just a second. And done! <laughs> of course you had to show that this is your book. And what will we have on the other side? Oh yes, here's our Sam again. Great. Girls, wait a bit and we'll merge you into the book. Sam, the superior builder and designer knows what... Whoa, whoa, whoa. <sighs> oh wow, you already have the design. Well done. Now I'll glue it and then we'll go inside. Oh look, Wednesday decorated her half of the room all by herself. Hey, then I'll take care of the furnishings of Enid's half. Uh-huh. <laughs> So good to see you, Wednesday. You'll help us. If we work together, it'll be much faster. Sammy, you don't mind, right? The main thing for you to do is to ask me what and how to do. <laughs> no problem. We'll do everything under your strict control. Great. Then let's get to work. What will you and Wednesday do? Make a pick. Hey, don't push. I'll tackle everything now. Oh, show me what's in this hand. Ooh, hair. It means you and Wednesday will take care of the wigs. <laughs> we'll see who has the best ideas here. <laughs> In the meantime, while they're busy, I'll prepare the outfits. And the wigs for Enid are done. Hey, Wednesday's got some hairstyles too. <laughs> you both did great. Now it's my turn. I'll put everything in its place. Uh-huh, and this goes there. Hurry up, wigs. The book spread is closing. Well... Is everyone here? Then let's move on. You can try, but you won't defeat me! Stop! <laughs> stop! I have something uh, better in mind than arguing. Uh, Remember the boat race? Who'll participate this time? The boats are here, but there are no participants so far. I know! I'll bring those who's in my team! Choose whomever you want. My team will win! Wait for now. You better compete on the actual field. Here's the star. The dice went flying. <laughs> so what do we have next? Hey, I can do some stuff too. Here. Oh, thanks. Oh, these are some beautiful chips. <gasps> you can do that too? Oh, it's so great to craft when both of you are so much involved. Want to see a trick? Hop. And all the families together. Oh, I'm gonna show you something. Uh -huh. <laughs> all done. How do you like it? Wow, well done, Sammy. It's time to move on to the next book spread. Here we'll glue the figures of Wednesday and Thing. They will hide. Drum roll. <laughs> let me find where they will hide. Uh, and here it is. The notebook. Uh, let me check it out. Maybe I'll find something interesting. Feel free to do that. There's a lot of useful stuff in that purse. Aha! Uh -huh. That's what I found! The anti stress doll! All right, here it is. I love these dolls. And we have the next spread in line. Where is it? I know where it is. I took care of some things and prepared it. Oh, how kind of you. And I prepared the coloring pages. Hey! <laughs> I can't resist it when Sue and I are crafting. And you already started coloring. Cool. 
In the meantime, we'll still have one more book spread. I urgently need to show off my talents here! On top, there's a place for hearts. Sammy, have you seen the puzzle? Yep, I put everything together in a beautiful envelope. Great, and we're done with our playbook. Well, almost. We only need to glue the cover. Enid and Wednesday are already waiting for us there. Sammy, call the toys. Let's tell them the story. Once, the sweetest little girl got into Nevermore, a school full of monsters. Ooh, spooky, right? She had to overcome hard challenges when she... Uh, <laughs> what are you doing here? You had to stay behind the curtains. Unbelievable. And right behind my back, too. The story finale was awesome. Give us a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Bye-bye. And scene. No, 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 that won't do. I asked for a drama. about this whole story. What now? Are you authorized to be on the set? This is our new screenwriter. He's promising. Take a look, Mr. Director. Promising, huh? Hmm. Uh-huh. Hee <laughs> hee. Huh? Oh, my feta, huh? Oh. This is genius. This is exactly what I needed. <laughs> We're filming that immediately. Ooh, I'm going to be famous. <laughs> Scene one. Take one. Action. This story happened a pretty long time ago, when the thing had just been born. It's time to go to bed, Rugrat. Your beloved mommy is already here. She was just about to sing a lullaby when suddenly... There, there, sweet baby, don't cry. Mommy knows how to calm you down. Here's a warm bottle of baby formula. Tasty yum yum. Now that's what I call a working life hack. If you're hungry, go like this. Hey, that's not in the script. I'm improvising. Go on, Sue. Baby Thing ate well, uh-huh, and his mood immediately improved. But you do remember what little babies do after having a bottle? <laughs> You're making noise again! Hush, or you'll wake up the whole neighborhood! Someone needs a diaper change. Oops, mommy, we have a serious problem here. Okay, don't panic, I know a perfectly good specialist. Dr. Sam is here! Whoa, to the clinic, stat, I'll meet you there. Here's the ambulance, go! Paperwork. And I'm gonna prepare everything necessary for the treatment of our patient. What is this, a vitamin drip? Good, very good, but we need more wipes. Oh, we've got plenty in stock. Whoa, ha ha, I meant wet wipes. Ah, uh, how rude, Susan. Well, we figured out the stage, let's move on to coloring. Get some brighter colors. It's a children's channel after all. Ooh, that's right. Well, let's get started. Now we need a neat cut. And let's move to the hospital room. What? Where is it? Nurse! I'm here. I'm here. Stop yelling. I work as fast as I can. Oh, I can already hear the footsteps. We'd better speed up. This goes here, and we're done. Please, go ahead and don't worry about anything. The doctor will see you now. Well, hello, baby thing. The good doctor will cure your boo-boo. Here we go. First, we need to treat the sore spot. And now you have to be a little patient. It's a pain reliever. Calm down, mommy. Don't scare the baby. A little bit more. Great. Now all your pimples will disappear before our eyes. One pimple. Ouch! What are you doing? Oh, sorry, Sammy. I confused you with the baby's, um, lower back. Just a little bit left. We're almost done. We need baby cream. It's on its way! 
Give me just a few seconds. Uh, shell from the beach. A phoenix feather. Some mermaid scales. And here is my... Ow! Brr. This is my cream. Special recipe. Are you sure about this? Oh, ew. We better take the good old baby cream. We'll need just a little bit of it. Approximately this much. You should take home the rest. Apply it in the morning and evening. And everything will be just wonderful. Well, how are you now, baby? Super! Such a great boy deserves a lollipop. My favorite, though. Huh, <coughs> sweet tooth nurse. Hmm. Here, this is for you. And don't get sick anymore. Oh, well, in that case, don't go anywhere, friends. In order to film the continuation of our story, we need more actors. Let's make them bright. Mommy Thing has a lovely shade of lipstick. I've been looking for one like this for a long time. And Daddy Thing will have a remarkable mustache. As I get it, it's in trend now. Huh? Oh, that's about right. So now all this needs to be cut out. What? Ah! The girls decided to help us! Wait a minute. Enid can handle it on her own, and I could use you for something else. Okay, just a little bit more. I think she looks just like you! Dr. Wednesday? I have never heard about her! I only work with Dr. Sam. Huh. Improvise, Sammy! You are a talent! Well, where are the actors? Oh, thanks for the help, Enid. One, two, and three. We're all set. Give us a thumbs up, friends. We're getting started. An unknown virus has been found in Thing City. A particularly vulnerable category of the population is the hands. That is, the palms. Oh, no, something's wrong. That's why I always wash my hands thoroughly. Oh, Mommy, and you too. Even the baby got sick? Awful. We need to go to the hospital urgently. ER? Uh, uh-huh. Yeah, we'll be waiting. In the meantime, the Thing family is already in the ward and ready for treatment. The Red Cross case contains everything necessary. Dr. Wednesday is ready to go. Just wash your hands thoroughly first. Better do it twice. For starters, we will treat the inflammation with an antiseptic. Let's take some cotton. And carefully dab your... Well, you get it. Next, please. That's it. Great. <laughs> so that the baby is not so nervous, we need to distract him. What beautiful candy! Very well! A couple more moves and that's it! This is an anti-pain medicine. Baby is the first... Mommy, you're up next! Great! And finally, we have... Daddy? Oh, where are you going? Stay still! It doesn't hurt that much, does it? Just a sec for the medicine to kick in and... Poof! Yeah, only we'll have this poof a little less grandiose. What a shame! If only the character would fly away from such a poof. To Mars! And there... Oh, this is it! I have an idea for a new movie! Come on, write it down before I forget it! Uh-oh. <laughs> Looks like the medicine is wearing off. Hang on a little longer, big guy. Good thing slimes don't get pimples. Hey, baby, look at me! Uh, friends, support our glorious thing family with your thumbs up. And we're moving on to the last healing stage. Let me apply some baby cream to relieve inflammation. What, is it ticklish? By the way, mommy, you can also apply it to your face. 
And last but not least, patient for today. Okay, it's all over now. We cured everyone. Thank you, Dr. Wednesday. I hope now you all remember to wash your hands thoroughly. And the main prize in the Best Movie Director category goes to... Slick Slime Sam, put your hands together! What? Me? Is it true? For serious? It's so unexpected! I didn't even prepare a speech in advance! Uh, so I would really like to give the hugest thanks to everybody who believed in me. Excuse me, hello! Hey, are you sleeping there? How long do we have to wait for our order? Three large ice creams. Oh yes, I'm sorry. Everything will be ready now. Let's hope someday Sam will become a great director. Hit the like button if you enjoyed this episode and don't forget to subscribe. Bye.